And one of the most useful uh, features of a website builder and most important is the ability to manage your images. And before we get started showing you how to do that, we want to talk a little bit about the way the Breeze is set up. It's set up with a concept called border areas. You've got a top and bottom and a left and right border area. And then we're going to change that image, which happens to be in the right border area. So to go to that border area, we click on Content, Manage Border Areas. We're going to select the right, select the right border area. And there's our image. Now we're going to go click on the image icon, which allows us to manage our images, which we've done. Okay. And what we want to do is we want to change that picture of a dragonfly to a better mousetrap. So what we're going to do is we're going to upload the um, picture we want right into uh, the website. And the Breeze does that for you, the FTP, automatically. So we're going to click on Browse. Okay. And now we're going to go uh, select the uh, Better Mousetrap. So we're going to browse for that. Pull it off of our computer. There it is. And we're going to click Open. Okay, and then we're going to click Upload. And automatically it is FTPing the file to our server, which we then will take, if we can find it here. There it is. Click on that. Boom! We've got it in the, in the breeze now. Okay, so now a really nice feature we have is we can change the width of it. We're going to change it to a width of 200 pixels automatically okay and it automatically does it uh, to scale all right and hit okay all right um, next what a real nice feature that we have in the breeze is we can optimize images obviously if you have a huge image it'll take a long time to, to load so we're going to go click on optimize images and the image has now just been automatically resized to the 200 pixels. Now another feature which is really important and nice is that should you have uh, lost the larger image, there is a backup automatically kept. And there's a button called Reset Image. If we click on that, boom, the image is back to its original size. But we're going to optimize the image. And all we have to do now is hit Publish which will publish it to the site. And we're going to click on See Site. And there you can see we've got the better mousetrap image into our website. 